everyone, it's Monkey1000 and tonight it's late. It's almost one o'clock in the morning. It is New Christmas Eve. I was going to say New Year's, but it's Christmas Eve. And yay, we are 24 hours and Santa will be here. So, anyway, so anyways, I got a recipe I want to do. I did this once before, so I'm going to do it again, but I'm going to add some little sprinkles to it. And I'm going to try to do it that way. I got some pretzels here. I got the mini ones. You can get the bigger ones if you rather. Whatever is easiest for you. And, of course, I got my favorite, the chocolate in the microwave. So, stay tuned and we will get this moving. Okay, guys. So, the first step I'm going to do, I got some parchment paper. I put it on my cookie sheet, okay? I open up my pretzels here. I'm not going to use the whole bag. I'm just going to use some. I'm not going to make a bunch of them. Um, just enough so you guys can see. I'm going to spray this on the parchment paper so it doesn't stick. Very good tip. Then we're going to take the chocolate and we're going to put it in the microwave. So I'll be back after it melts. Okay guys, so I got it melted. Shea Bear helped me with that one too. <laughs> I didn't want to chance it. Now I got the small ones, so I'm just going to kind of dip them a little bit halfway. That's all I'm going to do. And there we go. Let the excess get off. Just take the excess off. And these are something you can do with your kids too. I mean, you know, they're not going to get hurt. Just make sure you do the, the chocolate in the microwave. Or if you're going to do it over the stove and do it the other way, you can do it that way too. Whatever you prefer. I'm just going to stick them on here. Sorry. Put my other hand in there. Get a little bit more. There we go. I didn't think I was putting enough on there. You can cover them the whole way or you can do half and half. I'll do a row like this and then I'll do a row that's fully covered. These are great for parties. You're going to have a bunch of people come over and you know you need something quick. And uh, if you buy this in the microwave, for the microwave, then that way, you know, it doesn't take any time. You don't have to worry about your chocolate burning. Unless you're me, that knows how to burn chocolate real well. So, yeah. oh well. It is what it is. So I got him to do it for me so I don't botch it up. I just take it. And we're gonna just scoop it on the side. Okay. I hope you can see that. I'm gonna bring it over here so you can see it. And what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put a little bit of sprinkles on here. Now you've got colored ones, you can do that. I just put some sprinkles on these. There you go. So I'm going to do another row. And the next row I'm going to, I'm bringing you back over, sorry. Don't need to mess you up here. And I'm going to cover the whole, whole thing. So you can see both ways. And I'll we'll just do it this way. Get all the excess off, which as you can. Take it on the side. And just scoop it onto your paper. Okay, I'm going to do several of these. I'm going to do it across. Get all that excess off. Winners keeps going back and forth. He knows I'm cooking and he can't have any chocolate, so it's driving him crazy. He would love to eat this, but I can't give him chocolate. Of course not. He's a dog. 
So I'm gonna take whoops, take another one, get it rolled in there. And kids would love to do this, you know? Fun. I had fun with my other video. So stay, you need to watch it. If you haven't watched the other one, you need to watch my other one that I did. Okay. And just roll it on there. Yeah. Take it. Get as much of it off as you can. Trying to put them in a row is not working. Okay. Throw them on here. And then this goes pretty quickly too. You make as much as you want. I'm going to make a pan. That's all I'm going to do. I think that's enough. Or I might not. I'm, I might use all the chocolate. I don't know. I could do that. I guess. So I don't waste it. And... Yep, you can give these to your friends, your neighbors, you know, people who like to eat, like chocolate, chocolate lovers, lots of chocolate lovers out there. Okay, I'm going to bring you back over here real quick because I want to show you. I'm going to put the sprinkles on that one. I'm going to bring you closer so you can see a little bit better. <clears throat> okay, so I'm going to take these sprinkles and put them on top. Ooh, I just poured them on there. A little bit too much, but I'll shake off. Here. And we'll go back over here. Okay, so next one I'm just going to dip them. Yeah, I'll just dip, dip them halfway. You can use white chocolate on top too if you like. Drizzle some white chocolate on top. Do half and half. Be creative. Do what you like. I didn't buy no white chocolate, so if I did, I would have maybe done both together. And these ones, I'm going to leave them without the sprinkles on them. Not everybody likes sprinkles. Got to make a variety. You know? These move pretty fast. They don't, they're not that, don't take that long really. Depends how many you want to make. Depends how many people are coming to your party or how many you want to give out. You know? This row. Okay. Next one, I'll just cover them all. That drip through. Yeah, we'll do it like that. Oops, got my fork in the way. 
Okay, so I'm going to do these and then I'll come back when I'm done. Okay, guys, so I found some um, candy that I had up there. So I'm going to sprinkle some on these ones so you guys get an, uh, an idea. Of, this is like a unicorn thing. I don't remember what I used this for, but I used it for something. And so I was trying to see if I had any more sprinkles or anything up there. But you can put candy on. I'm just trying to show you a different way. I'm just going to do one row. So, yeah. So we'll see what that looks like. When it gets hard, they stick on there. So I can probably put one more row down here. And I'll be done. And so on the next row, I'll just make it plain. So I'll be back after that. Okay, guys, so I got this one done right here. That's about all I'm going to make. I'm not going to make any more than that. You know, we're diabetic. We're not supposed to eat these. And, um, you know, Shea Bear, you know, he might eat a few of them. But he may not eat a bunch of them either, so. Um, so I got the idea. Very simple. You know, you got some people coming over tonight. And you don't know what to do. And you just in a hurry you can make these you could do it with your kids and have fun with them you know I put them all on a plate here here you go on a plate and you can make them all different colors if you want do red and gold and, and silver you know if you can find that and then I did some you know just without I'm gonna do one more row here and then I'm gonna put it in the um, fridge for five minutes and then we'll come back and I will taste them in front of you and see how I like them. So stay tuned. Okay guys, so there you go. I made a pan. I got lots of chocolate. And I'll probably make a cup, maybe another pan. Now I'm going to throw this in the fridge for about five minutes. And then I will bring them back out. Okay guys, so there you go. They are finished. <laughs> and it was quick and easy. You can break it off if you want, but I don't care. It's fine. Mm. Very good. Nice and tasty. They're really good. Pretzels and chocolate always go good together. Right, baby? Whatever you say, huh? Hmm. Okay. Yeah, they're hard. Um, uh, mm -hmm. Yeah. Good? Yep. Well, I don't I didn't have any, but they look good. You want some? No, thank you. <laughs> I'm eating pepperoni. He's having pepperoni and cheese. So, anyways, that concludes that recipe. If you call it a recipe, it really isn't. It's just a quick and easy thing to put together. And also, if you want to have fun with your kids, something you guys can do together. And, uh, watch the other video that I just put up and um, yeah these are two easy ones now these ones here they take a little longer than five minutes so um, yeah but as you'll see on my video it, it take a little bit longer but not real bad okay so that's it for now monkey says she's out I'm tired and I uh, I think I'm going to upload my videos Only and have me a shower and I have dishes to do too. So, <laughs> <laughs> bye guys. Shea Bear says bye and I'm going to say I'm out for now and if I don't get another video up I hope you all have a great Christmas and have a great day. I'll try maybe to put another one up on, you know, maybe this evening or something. Um, we'll see. Can't promise. But, um, yeah. So, there you go. And I hope you enjoyed the videos. And watch the ending of my other one. Because it's supposed to be funny. And, uh, so, there you go. So, and there'll be more coming up. So, stay tuned for more. Monkey says she's out for now. Bye, y'all.
not. I used that whole box. Yeah, but how much are you supposed to use? He didn't say. I don't know. I'm sure, he's got to say. He didn't use enough cookies. Oh, no. Yet. Oh my god! Well, I'm doing my rack, it's okay. Not yet! Because <laughs> now the form around that rack doesn't get work to get off. If you went for. Oh my god. I'm going to put it on here. Yeah, but he did. 